Hey there everybody, this is a tutorial for the Klungo cutscene skip. It's the very first trick of the game where you skip the Klungo cutscene. <laughs> uh, right at the very beginning of the game, if you walk through this entrance into Spiral Mountain, you get this cutscene that plays where Klungo, you know, runs into the digger tunnel um, ahead of you. So, in order to skip it, we have to jump around it. And the only way to do that is to jump over these rocks over here. So one thing that I like to look at here is these two little white dots to the right of the arrow here. If you stand on them or a little bit before or behind or ahead of them, you'll pretty much be able to make over it. So what you want to do is just kind of stand in this vicinity and you want to just do a backflip and land on the little ledge over there. So just hold right, a little too far forward. Stand on the line, backflip, and you made it. Um, you can do it from a little bit further back, but the further back you are, the harder it is to actually make the backflip. Uh, you might need to beak bust a little bit later, but if you dip too low into your jump, like so, you kind of trigger the cutscene. So you don't want to be too far back, otherwise you won't, you won't make it. But uh, depending on where you jump from, you can kind of delay, or uh, you can kind of delay your jump a little bit, more or less. But I mean, in the end, you just kind of want to be in this like general vicinity, and then jump and make it. Second thing you don't want to do is to re-trigger the cutscene by like falling off. Um, once you've made it onto the rock best thing to do is just kind of like get up and like land over here on this little patch here. If you land kind of on the right side of the rock, you can still trigger the cutscene. So kind of, you know, do your backflip, land somewhere near the middle, Talon Trot, and you're good to go.